Hello. Hello. Well, hi, Judy Greer. How are you? <laughs> Good. How are you? And Nat Faxon, thank you for joining us both here in Dallas, Texas. Oh, oh thanks cool. for having us. Well, look, I'm going to start with Judy. Women are always first in my world. Thank you. I want to talk yeah. about the descendants, you know, the descendants to married life on FX. Tell me about this. Um, well, the transition, you mean? It was really, um, I don't know, The Descendants was a really sort of, I think, pivotal movie in, in my career, for me anyway, and, it, and um, I was really thankful for the opportunity to get a chance to play uh, such a real character and, and someone that had, um, in not so many scenes, like such an incredible journey, and I think that it it helped maybe put me on the radar to, to be a part of a show like Married. Um, certainly the fact that uh, Nat and I already had a relationship um, before we started shooting the show added a lot of chemistry for us. And and the fact that he was already attached to being married when I read it, um, it had a big influence on me taking the role. Um and I knew that he wasn't writing on it, so I really wanted to be in the show, <laughs> knowing that he would not be writing smart. any any of the episodes. It's very smart. <laughs> well, Nat, let me ask you. You know, you're such a talented actor, and we know you're an Academy Award winning writer. How you do? How you loving married now? Uh, I thoroughly enjoyed the experience of work on the show. How I, come? Um. Brett Gelman is on the show, uh. Uh, Jenny Slate, um, Paul Reiser, John Hodgman, just wonderful surrounding talent um, that I got to be a, a part of. Uh, no, it was a wonderful experience in the sense that it felt very real and truthful and honest and, and dark. And for all those reasons, I think it was refreshing as an actor to, to <laughs> do that, you know, to play something that was a little, you know, rough around the edges. Um, it was surprisingly easy to tap into, and I don't know what that says about our marriages, <laughs> but for some reason, both of us had no problem. Sliding <laughs> right into dysfunction. <laughs> well, you guys seem to have adapted very well, especially, if I could say this, you know, Nat, because, you know, you won for best adaptation of a screenplay in The Descendants. Now you come to marry. Do you kind of like... I'm the Oscar winner. Let me tell you what to do. Or do you play your part? No, I definitely bring the Oscar to the set. <laughs> yeah. And put it right up on top of the monitor. Yeah. And just say. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Uh, no, I. Uh, it was a very nice um, uh, departure as far as just acting in this solely. And I had such. Um, love for the writing and the scripts and I, I just didn't want to I didn't want to involve myself in it because I felt like I would probably just screw it all up so I it was very enjoyable just to be an actor and to read the lines and to get to you know play around with Judy um, it was fun I, I thought like the in the very beginning you know I, he's directed the way way back and wrote it and wrote the descendants with his partner and I was like what's it is he gonna be like is he going to have any? And he was like, um, no, I just want to be an actor. I just want to sit here and drink my iced coffee and text until it's time to act again. I was like, really impressed. You, had you no guys problem. do no have good, you guys have great chemistry. You know, I hear it. I think I see it on the screen. What, what, what gives you this, this chemistry thing? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. We just are so fortunate that it happened. We have a very similar work ethic. Mm -hmm. and um, As in none. As in none. So. And I think we have, like, um, I think pretty rewarding lives outside of our jobs, which mm -hmm. makes it nice when you come to work and you're both excited to be at work, but it's not. I, I don't know. It's okay. not like the end all be all. We have a lot to talk about, about not just work. Yes. I don't think we also, I feel like, have had good upbringings and are. We have had good upbringings. Normal, yes, normal, normal people. Normal people. We're like normal humans. Which helps. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. always a success formula, <laughs> formula. And I think Merit is going to really bring you guys wide acclaim out there in the landscape where there's so many shows. Let me ask you, you're on FX. Mm -hmm. You've got Mary coming to us. When do you want us to watch? 
Thursday nights at 10 p.m. Yes, and if you've missed episodes, you can watch them on FX now. That's what I was going to ask. You know, we love to have these binge watchings. Yeah, yes. that's, yes. yes. that's the best. You guys are great. Keep doing what you're doing, and we'll keep watching. How about that? I All right. like it. Thank Sounds you. Sounds like a plan. Thank you. Thank okay. You. Thanks for joining us this week, and we really, really enjoyed it. Oh, Thank right you. on. Thank you.